Now look! Oh, Brigshaw, it's you. I've just been informed that you have arbitrarily terminated the employment of Brother Jemson in the print room. Is this true, Rodney? Yes. Yeah. Uh, Without, I might add, any consultation whatsoever with either the convener, the joint shop stewards committee, or myself. Why was this man dismissed, Rogers? He was dead, sir. <laughs> dead. Yes, he was found dead at his machine. How did he die? Peacefully in his sleep. <laughs> I have the death certificate here. Well, I really can't see the problem. I mean, if Jameson's dead, then we really... Not officially. <laughs> Look, it quite categorically states in the Working Practices Manual, death shall be deemed to have occurred when and only when rigor mortis takes place. <laughs> I thought we'd agreed on brain death. No, if you remember, sir, the union felt that brain death might prejudice the status of their living members. Oh. <laughs> so how long ago did this man die? Brother Jameson became subject to involuntary immobilisation <laughs> about 18 weeks ago. 18 weeks? Good Lord Rigor Mortis must have set in by now. Well, it hasn't. Uh, no, sir. Um, Mr Brigshaw had the body strapped to one of the central heating radiators. <laughs> Brigshaw. Safety reasons, I'm afraid. I could not allow my members to take the risk of slipping in the ooze that was emanating from my member. Ooze? <laughs> God, the body must be absolutely... Oh, and that's another thing. We'll need complete sets of breathing apparatus in the print room, new air conditioning, and, I would suggest, triple wages for Brother Jameson, who throughout this difficult period has been available for work on a three-shift basis. <laughs> Just one more, eh, hey, Aaron? Just one more job. Look, I'm straight now. All that's behind me. I've got to think of my family. I'd be so ashamed if... It's just one more job, Harry. You don't have to get involved. Nobody will recognise you. Just look upon it as helping out old friends, eh? All you've got to do is drive. <laughs> Vote Haddad, your Conservative candidate.